Hey everybody, so on today's episode of the Gumbo Channel, we're going to take a look at this guy right here. I know, looks like a mess, doesn't it? But I promise you this is an incredibly useful tool if you have Boy Scouts, Girl Scouts, or 4-H'ers at the house, or if you're just into preparedness. This is a not practice board. So, I'm going to show you how to make it next on the Gumbo Channel. So I thought I'd give you a close-up of what we're looking at here. So basically, you're going to give them the knot, and then you give them something to practice the knot with. So here we have the square knot, the official knot of the Boy Scouts of America, and then we have two lines to practice that square knot with, right? You have a knot, and then lines to practice that knot with. You notice that I just put granny knots on the front side and on the back side or loop them around, right? That way they don't come out, right? So you can even teach them how to tie their shoes. If you're doing with Cub Scouts and they don't know how, well, here's a perfect way to teach them how to tie their shoes. How about a stopper knot? Want we'll to teach them how to do a stopper knot to make a rope ladder or a climbing rope? Well, then you give them a practice rope to practice that on. How about the bowling, right? Everybody has trouble with the bowling. Well, now you have a practice line to do so. How about hitches, right? So on this carry handle, which is just a cut piece of PVC, right? You give them the knot, whatever it is. This is a clove hitch. You could do a timber hitch. You could do any type of hitch, and then you give them some line to practice with. So that's all it is. For a few dollars of material, right? I think uh, I bought all this at Home Depot. Uh, I think this is down to about four or five dollars per board. You could certainly make them smaller. You don't have to make them as big. I made them that big because it just was easy and it seemed to work out that way. It also fits in a backpack, but I just cut up a bunch of the boards, then I cut up a bunch of rope. You could also use 550 cord. Uh, this just happened to be uh, the cheapest rope that uh, Home Depot had for sale. Um, so, and then you just put it together, right? That's all you do. It's really, really easy. You could make a bunch of these in an afternoon. These are perfect for Boy Scouts, Girl Scouts, 4-H, and just general family preparedness. So, hope this helps. It's a quick little fast tip. Hey, so, I hope you really enjoyed this fast little quick look at a not practice board. Because after all, how do you get good at something? Practice. I've never met an adult or a child that I was able to hand a piece of rope to and say, here you go and then they just knew that knot. Very, very few, maybe a granny knot, right? That's the only knot I can think of. All other knots have to be practiced. And the more you do it, the better you get at it. And then eventually you develop good habits and it just becomes second nature. And where you start is right here. This is a quick, easy thing to do. It doesn't cost very much, four or five bucks for a setup, maybe cheaper if you bought more. You can make them really, really fast. So you can make them for every kid in your troop or every kid in your pack. You can pass them out at school. You can give them to kids to fiddle with on car trips. You can use them at church meetings. You can use them anywhere at any time, right? I kept one in the back of the truck forever for the kids to practice with. I also put it in their Boy Scout bag. I also kept them by the TVs. While they're sitting there watching TV, they can practice knots. This is not just a Boy Scout thing or a Girl Scout thing. This is a fantastic life skill Everybody should do it. Everybody should know how to tie these knots. So, as always, I hope you like this type of content. I'm trying to make these videos really, really fast and condensed. So if you want to see more, leave a comment down below. Um, if there's something I didn't show you, please let me know. I'll, I'll do a further video. But if you like this, please like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the little bell icon if you haven't done so already. And as always, be safe and be good.